Ah. Uh, I don't know if if there's anything world of horror about taking a bath. But I want some I want some extra wait, which one which one costs me XP? I think it's the regeneration, right? No. It's memory extract, so I want some extra reason. So I have more of that. We have 63 Doom. Um let's take a peek through my people. Someone is watching me. I think. <laughs> we have a stalker after all. Hasn't shown itself yet. Um Hi, by the way. We have an elder gem, you let a blue gem in the forest note. It still vibrates slightly in my hand. I can't even sell this thing. I can place it in the storage, but anyway. Next mystery. We've did oh god, we only did two so far? It's because I failed a lot in the past episodes. Okay. The next one is the violent vigil again. Death cheated. Well at least I didn't die last time. Uh, okay. Wait a second, let's not do that, because I can't heal up in this one. The Sorrowful Saga of the Moonlight Sailors. I'm pretty sure I can visit my home in this one, even though it costs me doom. It is... better... than, like, dying outright, right? Okay, the Sorrowful Saga of the Moonlight Sailors. It began with one fisherman who dragged something truly awful from the belly of the ocean. A dark, writhing ooze that mesmerized him beyond c control. He sticked his stick in it. He hid himself away for a week, adoring it. <laughs> That's like a euphemism. Not to be seen until one moon moonlit night when a young girl spotted his boat drifting away. A single lantern swinging at the helm and a captivated fisherman singing eerily to his catch. Now more and more fishermen have begun to find the vile oozes in their nets, and one by one they are disappearing. Soon, the ocean will have taken them all. Good. Immediately, going home to rest. <laughs> Even if it costs me doom, I don't care. Can I do it? Oh, I can do it several times. Oh yeah, I'm doing it once more, that feels good. Having more than 10 of both. Uh, yeah, we look better now. We, have, we also have two funds, I might go to the hospital again. Um, oof. actually no, I don't have any items equipped yet, do I? Oh no, I do have the compass. I need a slot B item, let's check up on the Shiba Inu. Let's leave. Um, can I not just leave the hospital? Hello? There's no leave button, is there? Shit. Okay, um... Great. Let's enter the doctor's office then. <laughs> I should risk stealing another bottle. Oh no. Okay, fuck this. Uh, I need to discard two item cards to complete this quest. I can discard the... No, I can't. Why can I not discard the forest node? Do I need it in another mystery? Why do I still have this? Let's put it in the storage. Okay, um... Let's shop for items. Maybe there's a cheap item I can discard. <laughs> Who knows? Otherwise I will have to look for improvised weapons again to discard them. During a fight. Okay, oh look! One dexterity until the end of current mystery? For one fund? It's pretty good. Plus one reason adds a new status. Another compass? Or slot B item. I'm getting the energy drink. Yes, I'm drinking that. Holy shit, yes. 11 decks. Oh, look, using an item counts as discarding them, apparently. So if I use the Elder Gemulet. Interesting. Okay, let's just investigate downtown. We're, we're gonna find a combat encounter and then um, also find. Ooh. You can cast one spell without paying anything. Um, the one that costs XP. We are very close to leveling up. Good, good. So what was I saying? Oh yeah, I'm gonna find a, a weapon and then discard that and then the quest will be complete. You've braved the stench for hours. I glean nothing besides the fact the fisherman had a wife. Perhaps I should pay his wife a visit. Gladly. Can't wait to level up again in a second. Old friend! We had this one a few times now. Uh, I think I invited her for a coffee every time. Let's just chat this time. 
We failed, but we got a reason out of that. Which is good in my book, to be honest. When you arrive at a fisherman's house, it stands long vacated, peering in through the dusty window. I recoil in shock. Why? Why? Following a suspicious person, you enter an old rundown mansion room. It stinks like spoiled meal milk. <laughs> like like milk and rusty coins. <laughs> and there's only two doors, one of which you came through. You can't see the strange man anywhere. Leave through the other door, search the room. Uh, I'm gonna search because why not? I found an item, an empty bottle! <sighs> I'm gonna level up. The fisherman's wife lies in the kitchen, mutilated and covered with black marks. Oh no. She got blacked. Uh, plus one perception. Improved resting at home? Ooh, does this make sense? It's my first mystery, uh, third mystery now. Plus one knowledge. Hmm. Does this only improve the resting I do during a mystery, or does this improve the resting I do between mysteries? That would be useful to know, you know. Ooh. I can go high on perception, and I think I'm gonna go all in on dexterity for this playthrough, just to see if it works out, you know. If I can attack several times during one turn, that's just amazing. 12 decks. Good. Um, let's keep investigating. Maybe, maybe that's actually the way to play. Maybe I should have done this way earlier. <laughs> the round window of the crooked manor tower is calling you. You feel your strength drain away as you stare at the bright light. Uh, get lost in the light, fight this feeling, force yourself into hiding. Let's force ourselves. Um, we got reason and experience for that. You spot an old fallen tree and jump behind it, still feeling the unnatural light on your skin. Soon things calm down. I'm safe! I feel lucky now. <laughs> Surely someone else must have caught one of these. You look around, hoping to spot one of them. Oh, look, a hardware store. Oh, look at this guy. We can buy a flashlight, which would give us even more perception. A carpenter hammer. Small chance of recovering lost stamina after defeating an enemy. Hmm. A shovel? Wow. Wait, lower speed is better, I guess, right? Because this is this is speed 120. Interesting. It's only strength weapons in here. I guess it's a, it's a it's a carpenter store or something, right? Hardware store. Let's get a flashlight, though. Let's get a flashlight. And let's equip it. Because I have no item in my slot B. Wait. Did I not buy it? I don't have enough money. Oh, shit, I didn't have... Oh, of course. What oh, crap. Maybe I'll find some along the way. Then we can come back. Something pulls you towards the beach. A statuette half buried in the sand is calling you. Feeling your hands shaking, you take a step closer. Take it home or ignore it? I'm taking it home. The statuette is surprisingly heavier than it looks. Mesmerized, you take it home and wonder where it'll display it. It's a bad idea. Great. Is it in my home now, I wonder? The young man has glassy eyes and mumbles as he replies between caressing his catch. The beating movements in his arms disturb you. Oof. I finally need to discard an item. Maybe I need to discard my bottle. Hmm. Then again, getting another ending for this one could be good as well, I think. The old fisherman. I'm not buying them around, I only have one fund anyway, so I'm gonna talk to them. I failed, minus two stamina. Okay. Keep investigating the seaside location. The beach. Let's all go to the beach. Uh, while you walk through the crowded space, someone bumps into you and quickly apologizes. Ah, we succeeded! It's a perception check. Thank god we leveled it up. They stole my wallet, I quickly grabbed their arm, and they drop it before disappearing in the ground. A uh, crowd, even. Plus experience. 29 experience again. Ah, oh, shit. Can I still... Let's see if we can still complete that quest. Yes, we can! <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Miss Obama. You find a huge pile of nets and hooks prepared for the big hunt. You quickly throw them into the ocean. Maybe that'll stop them from sailing out. You think it... It still changed anything? <laughs> I'm not entirely sure. <laughs> Let's investigate the beach once more. I slip out at night and race towards the beach, terrified of what comes next. The full moon shines bright in the cloudless night sky. The ink-black ocean waves glimmer eerily. All the residents have drawn their shutters tight and locked their doors. Your footsteps are silent in the sand. The only sounds are your ragged breathing and pounding heartbeat. The other button is like blacked out, so I guess I did it too late. Too bad. 
let's continue. You arrived at the water's edge breathless. The possessed fishermen boats filled the horizon with their light. Tiny yellow spots navigating across a dark ocean under a dark sky. You cannot make out the figures on board. It's the fishmen. Must be. It's not the sailors. The black beings must have left their bodies. Shocked, you watched them sail their way out of the harbor. You're terrified at their power, but relieved that they did not drag their meat puppets with them. Okay, <laughs> that was the ending. The black beings never returned, yet mothers would not let the children play on the beach. Is that racist? Over time, people forgot the last time they saw a boat out on the waves. Although some claim they see strange beings come into the port at night. Sorrowful saga of the moonlight sailors. Ending A. Got XP, got more XP, got minus Doom. I'm very high on Doom. And another day. Oh god, it looks very close now. A weird epidemic keeps staff at the hospital busy. Skipping the line will cost you more. Great. <laughs> That's two current events. Thank you very much, game. Um, I can't do anything that raises my Doom anymore. I mean, I'm at 3 out of four, out of 5, but still. Let's take a bath. I need some more stamina. Good. I feel nice, though. I feel very nice. I feel good. I feel like I can do this. Take a peek through the keyhole. Someone is standing in the shadow watching my door. Call out to them. Come on. Oh, the statue! <laughs> it's here! Oh, the statue! It's so funny. Is there anything in here? No? Anyone outside? No? Okay, let's choose a mystery, then. Um, I really don't like this one, the Violet Vigil one. So let's do this last, let's do the horrible history of Household Hell. Apparently I did this before, I do remember the name, I can't remember what it was about. Okay, there are many old mansions around this town, the manor is one of them, supposedly haunted by the family of four who disappeared without a trace one summer, but is it the only tragic event that took place here? Or oh, is it the one with the cave system? Oh fuck, I forgot to change my color palette earlier. Shit. Let me just, um... One more. Okay, that's the last one. It's very bright. Oh god, whatever. That is true eye cancer, holy shit. Uh, I have to find a mansion. Okay, investigate the seaside location twice, though. I won't go home to, to rest, because the Doom literally doesn't allow it, I think. So... It's a seaside. Oh, I'm already at a seaside location. Shit, I forgot it was a new episode. I, I, as I said before, I'm recording this all in one big batch now. There's a rumor about strange lights appearing in the sky around the lighthouse. However, after spending the night, you don't see anything unusual. Minus one stamina. Shit. Another one. This town's docks are a mix of modern warehouses, small shops and bars where the alternative crowd gathers. An ancient wooden temple occupies the small hill at the town center. Look for a warehouse job, could give us funds, try to recruit allies, allies, pray at the temple, possibly regaining some stuff or maybe getting a spell. I think an ally could do the trick. We failed. We got doomed for that. Not only you fail to recruit anyone to help you, but when you leave the bar, you're almost certain someone is following you. Yes, I have a stalker, thank you very much. Oh, I got two things. The shield cover herald. I've learned the cliff. The mansion was built on is famous for its extensive cave system. Um, 444 Hertz. Yeah, I read this before in the Architects Journal. One house owner, however, decided to make use of the cave tunnel. It's a natural concert hall, he claims. Keeping those two items with me. Um, and investigate a school, I guess. Maybe I'll see what happens. Um, when I reach for- Oh, the blue gem! Why is the blue gem, like, spazzing out? It vibrates slightly in my hand, but... Look, am I- It's not my recording software, like, going crazy or something, right? I can't use it in this encounter, either. It's an old trophy case. I'm just gonna check it. Minus two reason. Grand Champion of the Cannibal Eating Contest, 1956. Great. It stopped freaking out. I tried to use it. Oh, oh, I didn't use it. I inspected it. Oh, shit. Did I fuck up? Did I fuck up? Uh, maybe maybe another time will come for me to use it. Uh, please tell me I didn't fuck up. 
My investigation is starting to take a toll on my health. I feel like I'm about to fall asleep standing up. How do I address my wicked state? Take a nap, buy a coffee, jog around the block. I'm gonna take a nap. Thank you very much. Plus one stamina and reason, but also plus doom. No. I keep forgetting that every time I spend some time doing anything, I get doom. Okay. Uh, sorry if I'm not reading this, but again, I did this one before. If you haven't watched the other episodes of me playing this game, what the hell are you doing here? They started very strong, and I feel like I'm getting worse over time. So you better watch the first five ones, and then stop. <laughs> that's, that's, that's my genuine and honest advice for the series. I'm having more fun as it goes on, but it feels like I'm getting worse at the same time. Cool air suddenly fills my mouth, it tastes metallic. Before I can react, I hear a low growling sound coming from behind me. It's Canis, the Lunar Cat. Dealing reason damage? Only 14 HP though. Um, very high chance to hit with more damage. Um, Look at this, one strong attack, one uh, regular attack, and a dodge to boot. This thing could be dead very soon. Uh, namely, if I do it smart, now. And another kick. Here we go, we leveled up again, I'm doing it, mom. I'll make it through the window, this is the abandoned mansion your friends have talked about. Let's explore it! Yes, but first let me level up. Um, charisma, knowledge, luck. Hmm. I wish I could forego one of, one of these and instead take one of these again. I have to go with more decks. <laughs> I'm committed now. Um, I guess luck since luck is like... A hidden stat might be worth it taking this. I'm not gonna reroll the perks. I'm at 95% doom now. I need to solve this one quickly. Very quickly. Okay, let's investigate a mansion. I unlocked an achievement. Oh. Oh, because of the doom, I guess. The investigation is taking a toll on you. You start to miss the most obvious leads, plus 4% doom. I think I'm about to die, everyone. Doom. End. Click a mansion's room to explore it. The key to the study must be there somewhere. I mean... If the playthrough is about to end, I might as well equip the Eldritch Amulet as well, right? It didn't do anything because we're at max reason, I believe. That's not great, I have to say. It's not great at all. Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay. And what happens at the end of the doom? Under the mysterious Arfulash influence, the city engulfed in chaos. All the eldritch magic made our planet a bright waypoint for the bloated old god. And a tasty treat. Within the next 10 years, Earth is going to be devoured and there's nothing you can do about it anymore. Amazing. I've perished. At level 4, on my fourth mystery, in a run that went too well to go on I guess. My playthrough lasted 56 minutes. I saw three mysteries, I saw 40 new events, four new enemies, and two new achievements. I'm gonna check the achievements again. Shit, that really hurts. God damn it, the one, here we go, uh, no. Investigate 20 locations with a compass group, I guess I did this one just now. Um, wait. Here we go, lose your playthrough due to doom. Gruesome totem item. 12.9% of achievements. Shit! Honestly, I thought this would go on longer. This is gonna be a short episode, I'm very sorry. I don't know if this will... Depending on when I'll upload this. And if the game already upload, uh, up, already updated. Or... <laughs> if there's another game on the horizon I want to play instead. I might continue this, I might not at this point. 
Ah, oh, it's annoying me. This could have been the one, you know? This could have really been the one, but I don't really want to start another one since I've been recording for like two and a half hours now, I think. And maybe a little bit less. Um, and I don't really have any more time. Ah. I feel bad about this. I hope you still enjoyed it. Uh, more World of Horror will will follow, though, sooner or later. Bye.